everyone, my name is Kelsey. And my name is Becky. And we are the Sorry Girls. And we are here to do more wedding DIYs, which I know you guys have requested and we're so excited to bring you. Today we are doing a floral table runner. Obviously these are all over Pinterest and Becky wants to hook it up for her wedding. They're so expensive and turns out they're actually not expensive to make them. The florists just charge you a lot for them. Yeah. So that's where we come in. All right, it's super easy to make. It was actually super fun and the end product is like goals. Pinterest, yes. goals. All right, so let's show you how we made this. To make this table runner of greenery, you're going to need some greens. We picked up leather leaf fern, which was about 25 cents a piece, salal, which was about 50 cents a piece, and silver dollar eucalyptus, which will run you about one to two dollars per piece. Some baby's breath, which was three dollars for the whole bunch, and some white roses that were $15. Before the roses, the cost was under $30. Amazing. The first step is to divide up any of your greens that might be too full. Once that's done, we're gonna start roughing in the shape of our runner. We started with the leather leaf fern to act as our base. We want our runner to come out from a center point, so halfway we switch directions, but this is totally optional. Next, we lay down the salal, followed by the eucalyptus dollar, and then some baby's breath for a pop of white. We know it looks messy at this point, but we're going to fix that right now. Take some wired paper cord and cut it to the length you want your table runner to be. we're going to take some floral wire and gather a small bunch of your greenery that you just laid down. We tried to grab one piece of each type of greenery, but this will depend on how many pieces you have of each. Wrap the floral wire around the stem of the bunch and with the remaining wire, attach that bunch to the paper covered wire. From one end, repeat this with your bunches overlapping each other until you get to the middle. Then start at the other end and work your way back to the middle, wrapping bunches and attaching them to your main wired paper cord. You can use any extra pieces to fill in empty spots that you're not happy with. This is what our almost final table runner looks like. So our last step is to add in some of the roses. The greenery will last the duration of your event, but you might have an issue with the flowers wilting. So a quick tip is to make sure that the stems of your flowers are in a flower water tube. Once your flower is in its water tube, you can place them into your table runner. We just place these in sporadically and you can secure them with more floral wire if you're transporting the centerpiece. To give you the full picture of how tables might look on my wedding day, we're styling the whole thing. Plates, cutleries, and glasses were obviously needed. We have these natural linen napkins with DIY menus tucked in. We use the same technique here that I did for my wedding invitations, so be sure to check out that video if you want to make your own. For table decor, we have these brass lanterns gifted to us by Beau Coop, as well as these blown glass mini tea light luminaries, which can be flipped upside down for varying heights, and these real wood card holders, which beautifully display guest name cards. We think the final product looked amazing, and it wasn't that hard to do. Make sure you check out the blog post for some gorgeous photos of the setup. so incredibly happy with how this turned out. It's like literally Pinterest goals. It's so good. We're also doing another Pinterest goals wedding video that kind of incorporates some of the stuff we did today next week. So make sure you guys tune in for that. Yes, and definitely check out the description where all the links to some of the table decor stuff I got from Bocoop will be listed. Yes. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked this video, make sure that you do give us a like. <laughs> and if you loved it, make sure you sub it. Sub it. All right, we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.